All right, it's been a while since I've done any video, anything lately. I've just been not really feeling it, and I really haven't had any income to do any other mods or anything of that nature to the truck. <clears throat> I'm waiting on some insurance money to come in and whatnot, but that kind of screwed me around. So for now, the trucks are gonna sit as is. I do need to get a brake controller put in this truck. It's ridiculous. I went and talked to a couple different dealerships, and they are talking like 600 bucks for this one that I want. It's I I just can't figure it out. I can order it online for 270. Put it in myself. Super easy to do these things. 600 bucks. That is not installed. So those of you out there, do not just be like, "Hey, I'm gonna jump on this. 600 dollars. You can get it cheaper. Look around." But over the last little while, I have been towing a few trailers. I've had to move some livestock around. Uh, haven't really been able to film that because had my daughter with me or somebody else with me and it's super loud kids screaming crying and I don't want to put you all through that so so far this year I have pulled 26 foot camper you've seen the little trailer there this truck has done an absolute outstanding job pulling camper stock trailer like most of my vehicles that I've got used come with about 22 to 35,000 K on them. So roughly about the same as what this 2018 has on it. It's got I think 24,000 K on it. And it, it tows like nobody's business. With that camper, short passing lanes or turning lanes getting back out onto the highway, you're at 110, just boom, just like that. Which is absolutely awesome. I love it. <clears throat> She's a little dirty. It's been raining. Was had to haul a couple. Had to haul a steer to the auction. He was one of the late ones, sneaky ones last year. So I had to take him on Monday. It had been raining, so this truck was out in, on the gravel roads in the rain and mud. And it absolutely awesome. Pulling trailers don't even feel them behind this truck, which is something I really like with this three and a half inch rough country lift on it. It does squat with a stock trailer just a bit. The camper, I barely, barely squats it. <clears throat> now, you guys have heard me talk about me wanting to get towing mirrors. After this Father's Day, I took my old man out, went pike fishing took his little aluminum boat dear lord yes this truck has a backup camera but I hate backing up them little trailers something that isn't as wide as a truck I'm trying to find it sucks so I definitely wanna see what towing mirrors get that little extra out behind the truck see what it actually looks like when you're backing up something I'm definitely interested in doing but I thought I'd just give you guys a little update on how this truck's been, what I've been doing with it. Lots of towing lately. Lots of towing. It's been doing absolutely amazing. Even with the high gas prices. As you can see. I need a new windshield for sure. That one's driving me nuts. I've priced one out. 250 bucks. This old girl, get a new one. So, definitely going to look at that as soon as this money comes in. Now, this little gem here, I don't know if I'm going to do a video on it, but I am peeling that off. Get it all off this nice aluminum bumper here, because it looks like shit, and I'm tired of it. <clears throat> this truck is, as you guys have seen, is half covered under warranty for a new paint job but like I said right now I don't have the money to do it so I'm not later down the road hopefully we can get it done but as of right now the truck will sit as is 
until I get this money or I sell my 22s. As soon as I sell the 22s, I'm going to do a couple things to the truck because they are long over need, long overdue and needed. But <clears throat> I will put a few pictures in the video here somewhere, probably towards the end of this with the horse trailer and this with the little aluminum boat. Horse trailer is 4,500 ish. Just the trailer itself. It's a 16 foot Southland tandem axle. So it's roughly the same as the 26 foot camper for weight wise with that camper fully loaded. So this truck has been doing absolutely amazing. My fuel mileage really is not any different whether I'm towing or just cruising down the highway, which is awesome. So there's just a little update on why I haven't been uploading or anything like that. I do, however, have roughly 13,000K on these Toyo Open Countries. I'm going to do a little video on those. I have some measurements from them of what they are. I'll probably post that video up. Probably do it right after this one, but we'll see. So if you guys haven't already, hit the subscribe button. Have yourselves a great day. See you next time.